But we begin with a high speed police chase ending with a hostage situation inside a Metro nail salon. The suspect was holed up inside Foxy Nails near Northeast 23rd and Kelly. News Force Kaitor K is there live. And Kaitor, what do we know right now? Police tell us the chase started in Midwest City before coming here to OKC. About 15 people were inside the nail salon when the armed man went through the front door right there. The salon manager says he already knew this was trouble because as the suspect came in a frenzy, he saw a fleet of police cars parking outside in the parking lot. And that's when everyone inside ran for their lives. Back up, the suspect is armed and dangerous. A possible domestic call in Midwest City quickly turns into a police chase all the way to Oklahoma City to Foxy Nails on the corner of Kelly Avenue in Northeast 23rd. He bails out of the car and runs into the business that's open with customers inside. Workers and customers tell us the armed man yelled for everyone to get out. That's literally all I had time to hear. I was already heading that way. He just yelled, you know, get and kind of curse them out, you know. Christina Brown says she was getting her eyelashes done when the suspect burst through the front door and they all started fleeing for the back door. I was scared as hell. <laughs> I was scared. All I can think of is, Lord, please let me out of here. I got kids. Yeah, I was just trying to, you know, get people off the floor because a couple of people fell to get out the back door. Officers spent about a half hour trying to convince the suspect to come out of the nail salon peacefully. Right in the watch, watch. He eventually did with no clothes on and was put in handcuffs. Nobody was hurt. Oh, we got out. <laughs> That's all I can say is we got out. Police are still investigating the possible domestic situation that happened in Midwest City. They say it's while they were there that the suspect went out of the house and then got in a van and drove to OKC. At this point, police aren't releasing the suspect's name. Live in Oklahoma City, Kaitor K, Oklahoma's News 4.